Hey everybody, this is Jeff Keller with Extreme Consulting, and in this video I'm going to show you how to move an asset to a different site. Now what makes this important is assets are at the site level, meaning that they have to be unique to each individual site. This means that you can have multiple assets with the same key field ID in different sites. But not, but not in the same site. And moving assets to a different site is going to be very similar to moving it to a different location, but it's going to create a different result once, uh, once you've moved to the different site. So let's uh, go to the select action menu. Now I'm just on a just a random asset that I've picked out. Notice the status is operating, and I'm doing this from the assets application. I'm going to go into the select action menu, click move modify asset. Okay, now if we're going to move it to a location, we would just do it right here, the two location, keeping it within the same site. To actually move it to a different site, we're going to have to go under the mass move field and change the site from Bedford to let's just say fleet now it fills in I'm gonna click apply notice the location has changed the two location I just click OK then let Maximo do its thing. Watch the circle go around. Okay. Now it says asset 11230 in site Bedford was moved successfully. So we'll click OK. And notice that the status is now decommissioned. And the checkbox moved is now checked in. Um, if you move it, if you move the asset to a different location, it's not going to check this box. It's only going to do this once you moved it to a different site because the uh, the asset is now decommissioned. And what it's telling you is that the asset wasn't just decommissioned because it was broke or whatnot. It was decommissioned because it's moved to a different site. So let's go back to the list tab and let's search for 11.230 again. But this time, make sure your site is cleared out. Okay, and notice we have two assets with 11.230 as the number. One's Bedford, one's Fleet. The Bedford one is the one that we just moved from, and remember that one is now decommissioned. Now we can click on the fleet one and see that it is operating as the status was before we moved it. Okay, if you have any further questions, um, make sure you hit up our wiki or our forum. So thanks for listening.